There is something that I am very interested to know. This room is... It looks very... What happened? What? You fell off the sofa, you stupid... I know I fell off the sofa, madame. There's no need to tell me. Everything I do is carefully planned, madame. I know that. Now then. Uh, what was I saying? Uh, listen, you, you daydreaming fool. What are you doing there? I mean... Can't you pay attention when I'm talking? Don't you know what I was saying? You're not listening to me. With the greatest respect, monsieur, I heard every word that you said. Would you be kind enough to tell me what it was that I said? You were talking about the closet, monsieur. You, yes? You were saying that when the closet door was opened, Maria received a bump on the head, and from that that you inferred that someone had been hiding in yes, the closet, she monsieur. she received a bump on... And listen, monsieur, next time I may test you without warning. So pay attention at all times. Yes, monsieur. Now then, whoever was in that closet opened the door and knocked Maria unconscious. And whoever the man was that was in that closet had a reason to be in that closet. How do you know it was a man? Because we found his fingerprints, Monsieur Bellon. And they were your fingerprints. Well, why not? It's my house. I've often been in that closet. For what reason? Last time was moths. Moths? Moths. Yes, moths. Maria was complaining of mirths. M mirths? Is that right, Maria, that, that you were complaining about these mirths? Yes, I did complain about moths. Oh, you mean mirths? Oh, yes, the flying mirths. You mean? Yes, of course, of course, of course. No, but wh what I do not understand is that in a household of this size, that the question of mirths should be brought to the attention of Monsieur Ballon, not one of the servants or the local moth exterminator. However, for the moment, we will pass over that, and we will continue to concentrate on another type of local exterminator. <laughs>